In this video, you'll learn how to make use of merchant retention tools in iPostPay's portal. iPostPay's offers two main data that helps greatly with merchant retention. 1. Merchants who are not transacting. 2. Merchants whose transaction trend is in decline. First let's learn how to get the list of merchants who are not transacting. Log in to iPostPays.com. After logging into the portal, you'll land in the Dashboard tab. Scroll down and you'll find the A Percentage of Transacted Merchants pie chart. The data shown is for the past 90 days. It indicates the percentage of your merchants who have transacted at least once and the percentage of those who haven't transacted yet. Click on the pie chart. At the top, there's a slider that allows you to customize the data calculation for a specific number of days. You can choose any duration from 0 to 90 days to view the data from the past. Click on the yellow part of the pie chart to get the list of merchants who haven't been transacting for the amount of days that you entered. Click on the action button on top and click download. Now, an Excel sheet will be downloaded with a list of all the merchants with their contact details. Agents can now reach out to these merchants and retain them before it is too late. Next, let's learn how to get the list of merchants whose transaction trend is in decline. In the dashboard section, scroll down to find Declining Sales Trend box. Click inside the box. You will get the list of all the merchants whose transaction trend is in decline. Click the download button to download the list of these merchants in an Excel sheet. A declining transaction trend for a merchant could indicate that they are looking for an alternative payment solution. With this list, ISOs and agents can reach out to them in order to retain their business before it is too late. Thanks for watching. For any queries, please contact support at